This is an example of evaluating a surface integral. Let's evaluate the surface integral of x plus z ds in parametric form where s is the first octant portion of the cylinder y squared plus z squared equals 9 between x equals 0 and x equals 4. Now in parametric form, the surface can be given as r of x and theta equals xi plus 3 cosine theta j plus 3 sine theta k, where x is between 0 and 4 and theta is between 0 and pi over 2. To evaluate the surface integral in parametric form, you want to begin by calculating the following. You want to find the partial derivative of r with respect to x and r with respect to theta. Then you're going to find the cross product of those and then the magnitude of the cross product. So the partial derivative of r with respect to x is simply 1i. And the partial derivative of r with respect to theta ends up being the negative 3 sine theta j plus 3 cosine theta k. You want to find the cross product of those, and you get negative 3 cosine theta j minus 3 sine theta k. Now you want to find the magnitude of this cross product, and that will simplify to 3. So the surface integral can be written as x plus 3 sine theta. We make the substitutions. 3dA, and then our bounds for theta and the bounds for x go from 0 to pi over 2 and 0 to 4. Evaluate the inside integral and simplify, and then you get a single definite integral. When you evaluate that and simplify, your result is 12pi plus 36.